Namaste everyone, I'm Akshat and thank you for tuning in to my vlog. Today I'm talking about my latest science fiction book which is up on StackMe and it's called An Android Awoke on Moon. <laughs> Alright, so as you can tell from the title, it's about androids who gain sentience. Actually, it's specifically about the first android who gets the meaning of being alive mechanically of course because their bodies are not uh, finite like us in fact they are the opposite of us because they can be upgraded and i think this is going to play into the plot of my next part which is going to be an android dreamt because when you are alive your mind never shuts down your mind only shuts down when you are six feet under <laughs> which is another great awesome max series that i have been uh, you know sort of using as my uh, late night tv watching sometimes on weekends and uh, it is great because each episode starts with a death and it's unrelated to the overall plot but its burial plot plays into the plot okay wordplay aside let's get back to an android awoke and my heroine is called Selena. She is moonborn. So this is 400 years into the future. And we as a species have already well and truly colonized the moon. And we are just starting to establish a very permanent presence on Mars. So this series is going to be called the Martium Chronicles because Martium is an element that we have discovered on Mars that has some very unique properties that can help us in space flight and in exploring space which is where I think our future is headed because no matter how much underwater you go you're still on earth right and there is a finite amount of space whereas in space it's infinite so with that uh, Android Awoke basically starts off on the moon with the first android gain, gaining sentience and uh, Selena comes to become his ride back to earth so that he can achieve his ambition which is to reconnect with a, a couple of friends of his friends in quotes because uh, you know they are not yet sentient android 42 and i have named him lex 42 uh, lex is short form for lunar extractor because he is a mining droid but given a humanoid uh, shape and form so that we can program our androids to do the tasks that we would do and direct the machines that we would direct so has a little bit of computational mathematics a little bit of extra programming power up in his brain and that is what uh, sparks off the entire plot so all right uh, i hope if you like science fiction like i do you will check it out. It's on StackMe, which is a creator economy platform. Uh, you can delve into it right from the moment you click the link in the description below. All right. Uh, I think in my previous uh, long form video about books, I had mentioned that I did write a physical book as well. It's called A Life Afloat. And it's about my travels and my learnings from my travels throughout incredible India. Uh, I'll leave a description link for that as well and uh, that's it i guess i'll call it a day hope you all had a great dashera navratri durga puja and be kind to one another namaste once again and thanks once again for watching i'm akshat goodbye